Hey, this is Matt from Blacktop Mojo, and you're listening to Metal Nexus. Oh yeah. Uh, also noticed you had a hiccup on the road. And you oh yeah, on the way up here. Broke down. Yeah. yeah. Um, the first how's, time that's happened. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How's the road been treating you so far along with that? Uh, really well, man. Really, really well. well. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Been really cool to see uh, all the different faces and all the different people that uh, listen to our music that we never even got to meet before. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, fans really like your covers of Aerosmith, Phil Collins, and I really liked uh, the Blind Melons cover. Oh yeah. Um, uh, how many? How much planning goes into the covers before you're willing to really? Uh, I know the Blind Melon one was kind of like. Yeah, that one was. In the van. Yeah, and then uh, same thing with the in the air tonight. That was pretty on the spot right there. We just happened to be drinking at the distillery up there and found the found the big echoey room and, and just thought we might just sing a song. But uh, yeah. Uh, speaking of covers, are there any songs that you uh, maybe throw out there that will maybe? Uh, not, uh, we're working on the third album right now, man, and uh, there's no covers on it yet, but you know, you never know, you never know, yeah. Alright, um, so, you're currently promoting your Pledge Music campaign for the band's next album. Absolutely. Uh, which is yesterday reached 62% of the goal. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Uh, can you tell fans a little bit about the campaign and what it means to have you on the have support? Um, it means the world to have everybody support. Um, basically, you pre-ordered that third album and uh, you get it ahead of time and you get to kind of watch us make it. Uh, we make little videos and stuff behind the scenes and put our content out there, free stuff. Uh, and uh, it helps us, basically we're independent right now, so it helps us make our record. So, yeah. Um, yeah, you, you guys are, right now you are independent, uh, yeah. and you've had some chart-topping singles, like fine. Burning Ships was pretty successful. Yeah. Um, do you guys feel like you've proved yourselves? Uh, I don't think you ever prove yourself. I think you just got to keep getting better, man. Look at that. Yeah. Um, have any uh, major labels been knocking on your door of it? Uh, none, none, that, none yet? that we can uh, talk okay. about. Yeah. <laughs> Um, you're, you guys have a lot of like southern influence, um, and could easily be kind of crossover country, you know, that kind of thing, yeah. as well as hard rock. And uh, I know you've got some songs demoed for the new record, so what kind of progression have there been in new tracks? Um, it's, it's a little, uh, I don't want to say heavier. It's a little bit, it's, a, it's a definitely a progression, you can tell it's us, it's the same kind of, uh, it's groovy rock and roll, you know, southern rock, uh, it's got, that um, it's got a little bit of a blend to it, but uh, there's some there's some different uh, different instrumentation, a little bit of experimentation and stuff, trying to make some different sounds, and um, pretty excited, man, it's, okay. it's going to be fun. Can you uh, tell us who's producing it and where? Um, it'll be our uh, producer from the last couple of albums that's been helping us out, uh, Philip Mosley, the okay. guy, guy from our hometown, uh, okay, cool. and uh, we're probably going to re try to record it in our hometown, actually, this okay, time. Yeah. Um, there's a studio out there that we work out of. We actually shot the Dream On video there mm -hmm. um, and, and recorded Dream On there. Mm -hmm. And uh, working on acquiring that studio, actually. So uh, okay. we're, we're hopefully we we'll, might have our own space here pretty soon. Mm -hmm. So you've been on the road a good part of 2018, of playing clubs, festivals, and all that. Um, what's, what's in the books for the rest of the year for you guys? Uh, for the rest of the year, uh, we're actually about to get jump right into uh, recording here pretty soon in the next few weeks. So uh, we got some local shows and stuff back home. Uh, we hadn't played back home in a while, so uh, we're looking forward to uh, seeing all our hometown peeps and uh, just kind of uh, taking the rest of the year off and write and record and, and, and get that third album done. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's what I got for you. Thank Hell yeah. Thank you so much. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate it.